Has you ever heard the old saying, ye ain't never gonna see a U-Haul behind a hus? Yes, sir, we all know that story. But I can talk that story. It goes like, have you ever seen a dumbass on behind a hus? Not on it, but behind it. Here's the story, true story, very true story. I was rolling late, rolling late. I sees a hus comes on, and I see two miles of headlights. Just the headlights, I say, she's. I can't wait for this to fall off by me and make me late. So I got me an idea, a good idea. I turns on my headlights. Yes, sir. And I cut off the limousine behind the hearse with my headlights on. I was legal. I had my headlights on. Yes, sir. So as I commence following the hearse up the road, we get on the interstate. He must have been a poplar man, poplar man. We had a mile behind us. I says, I'm making good time. I wish this driver of the hoose would drive a little faster, but I just kept my pace, kept my pace with my headlights on. Well, as anyhow, I gets to my exit, and I was legal. I was legal as could be. I turns on my blinker. I merge on to the exit. The hoose keeps going. He just keeps going. I looks in my rear view mirror. To my surprise, to my surprise, that limousine and all the hundreds of headlights are following me off the exit. There goes the hus up the road. Go, they gave. Well, now it gets complicated as all of a sudden these motorcycle, run, run, motorcycle cops come trying to herd us back up. Herd us. They were herding us. Well, it got really complicated, and I had to explain that why I accidentally not following the hus. It was a traffic jam in my neighborhood. Traffic jam. Yes, sir.